Um, <laughs> what's the name? Um, WandaVision, uh, I'm just going to put this simply, was the best episodic show I've seen since The Watchmen. Wow. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put it Definitely. right there. It, um, it, there are, there's a lot of similarities, in my opinions, from a narrative standpoint to the Watchmen. Um, great job from the moment they started to the end. Uh, I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna let Pete jump in. Go ahead, go ahead. You got it, Pete. You got it. You got it. How, how, has, has Brian seen any of it at all, or no, man, is he completely? Uh, I'm rewatching the entire MCU, and then you know how I do it, bro. It's gonna be a while. Okay, really this is gonna be a rough thing because yeah, you, you it's gonna, gonna be rough by then and then get over there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I take I mean, it all back. I think they did a really good job setting up the universe, setting up what's been going on, and like the first three episodes are a complete mystery. Like, what the hell? Like you have no idea. I almost thought it was going to be kind of like a, um, like a Twin Peaks kind of vibe. Like it was just like a, a weird, like just what the hell is going on? And then as they started to reveal things in the outer universe, and things started clicking, like I was part of the group that was on that one rumor train of, oh, this is this is where they're going. This is what what's going to happen. And mm -hmm. you know, I was thinking the M word like everybody else, you know. And yep. then <laughs> the M word. Just, <laughs> the what M word. You what you <laughs> say? <laughs> but I mean, uh, uh, initially, I was a little disappointed with the ending. The, the last episode, especially, is great. It's a, it's they, it blew my mind. But at the same time, I was disappointed that it didn't didn't give that payoff that I was expecting. But yeah. it still opened up so much more. Like, there's so much they can do with it now. It's like they is. They answered stuff, and then they gave you way more questions just to be hyped for what the next movie is, which I think is uh, Doctor Strange, correct? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, now I got to watch it. Yeah. Now I got to watch it. Hold on. Doctor yeah. Strange, Doctor Strange, and then Peter Parker with the multiverse and all that? Yeah. Multiverse right, you know, I think starts with the Strange. That starts with Peter, Strange. And then yeah. Peter Parker has yeah. to come next. Okay, I'm watching yeah. that shit this weekend, bro. I'm binging that shit yeah, this weekend. You definitely got to. Well, it's I, it. and, and I just, you know, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, I think the episodes are they're short enough. They're only I think the longest episode is 42 minutes. So I mean, yeah. it's it's easy. It's easy to binge, and it's worth it. Bro, I've watched it twice. Like I've lapped it twice, just because yeah. it was worth it. Like it was that. Yeah, it's, Good. It was that good. Uh, shout out to Dank Tank. They the one that got me onto it. Like he he sat me down. He got me high. And said, "Watch this shit." I said, "Okay." And um, then I did it again on my own. I did the same thing and just ran the lap again. Uh, it's it's that good. It's not as good as The Watchmen, in my opinion, but in terms of comparing the two, it's right up there. It's for sure up there, for sure. Um, I like how uh, Black Twitter has uh, acquiesced itself to the entire uh, situation when it comes to the show. Um, Pete, I, I, I mean, Brian, I know you've seen the memes. Like, yeah, they've been memeing. Mean. Yeah, they've been, they've been on it. Um, what my favorite is uh, the, when he's got the turtleneck on and then they put the rock with his turtleneck on and then they give him the hair and bone chain. They give him the, <laughs> they match the chains up and then um you know they they giving them the 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 hat the dashiki breaking it down to the white vision and you know <laughs> it, it's they talk about now vision's half wakandan because it's vibranium in the suit <laughs> like they they've been all over it. they've been all over it. um i i i don't know how I wish they could do a number two. Because um, to Pete's point, um, the ending wasn't bad. It has some plot holes in it, in my opinion, but it wasn't bad. Um, it was, uh, but kind of like what they did with Ant-Man 2, who I think Pete is uh, secretly. Um, 
Ant Man <laughs> Two was a movie that <laughs> Ant Man Two was a movie that they found a way to move the story forward, uh, tease what was coming, and give you a, a decent ending all at the same time. And I think they did this again yeah. with uh, WandaVision. Um, I yeah, it, it, it's it was really good, bro. You you need to go on and. Unbox one of them systems, record yourself, and then go watch you some WandaVision for sure. For sure. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, it, it, again, oh, like and, said, it, it's a perfect filler to keep us. I'm sorry, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. Go ahead. I'll wait. I'll wait. No, it's, it's just like you said, it's a perfect filler. It's, I mean, it's been what? Almost, uh, it's been over a year since we've had any new Marvel content. And so this was the perfect way to get yeah. that fixed again and just, okay, well, what's next? Yep. So when is yep. when is uh, uh yep. Falcon Falcon and uh and uh Winter Soldier starting? That's Clarence. Pretty soon. <laughs> yeah, Cla Clarence and Winter Soldier. When is that? When is that? Clarence and the Winter Soldier. <laughs> that's coming up. Uh, shit. I believe that's the end of the month. Let me check. Yeah, the nineteenth. The nineteenth. Yeah, and I feel so sorry for them because they got to follow that shit. Um, yeah. good luck. Good luck. Yeah. They, because it, it's got, like, that thing has to be like Starsky and Hutch meets MacGyver to have a chance, to be honest with yeah. you. Because, <laughs> because, <laughs> because <laughs> he, man. <laughs> yeah. Right. Cause when, cause you know, you know, that was going right. to be straight action, straight. It's going to be the espionage action type thing. And, or WandaVision was the exact opposite. Like WandaVision had you feeling things. Like, <laughs> Like especially they, as they got closer towards the end, you saw like it, it had the nostalgia of all those old shows, and then especially when they got to the '90s and everything, like all that nostalgia, like oh shit, this is this is fucking awesome. Like I remember, I, like I know where they're pulling this from, and then just yep. with the interplay, the motion of the characters and what what's going on, it got you. It, it got you. It just just pulled you in with every episode, like to the point where it's like, fuck, why isn't the next Friday already? <laughs> <laughs> yes. so Winter Soldier, yeah, <laughs> right, right. So Winter Soldier and Falcon, they, I mean, that's gonna be, it's gonna be a tough one to like. They need to really bring the A game. Yeah. One other thing I liked about the uh, the Wandavision before we move on, um, that was the greatest finesse flex I've ever seen on an entire other. Uh, entertainment entity I've ever seen. The way they flipped the Quicksilver, I'm not going to tell you. Oh, God, yes. They, the the way they did that, like, like I was like, yeah. damn, Disney, damn. And it kept happening. Yeah. <laughs> it yeah. It kept happening. So, That's the thing. Yeah, but you need to, yeah, you need to give with that. Yeah. I'm going to do it this Thank week. Just when you thought, how are we going to top this? They do something else. 